Well, it's always an election year in Virginia, and Decision 2024 is shaping up to be a big one. And as 10 News reporter Sydney Jacksheimer explains tonight, there are a lot of questions surrounding the potential GOP nominee because of Donald Trump's ballot battle. 2024 is here, meaning the highly contested presidential race will be here before we know it. But there are many steps before November comes. First, the presidential primary. Virginia's primary is March 5th, falling in the middle of primary season, among other states. It could be all over by March 5th, or uh, we could play a role in deciding the Republican nomination. But before primary season kicks off, questions are being raised over whether former President Donald Trump's name will even be allowed on a ballot in states like Colorado and Maine. Could this happen here in Virginia? It's possible, Sydney, but I think it's highly unlikely. There's a number of lawsuits that around the country that have been filed under the 14th Amendment, and the people bringing the lawsuits are saying, well, the former president committed insurrection under the 14th Amendment, and since he swore an oath to our Constitution, he's ineligible to be on the ballot. In fact, an attempt to remove Trump's name from Virginia ballots was already denied by a federal judge just a few days ago. Former U.S. Attorney for the Western District of Virginia, John Fishwick, believes... My opinion is that he will be on the ballot and that he's not going to be held to be ineligible under the 14th Amendment. After all, he has not been found guilty of insurrection by uh, a jury, and Congress hasn't said that he was guilty of insurrection. Ultimately, it will be the United States Supreme Court's decision as to whether Trump's name will be on the ballot. Reporting, I'm Sydney Jacksheimer, 10 News, working for you.